Sergeant, be there in a while. Okay. Watch out for the captain, Sarge. He's going for the Silver Star. Right, Captain Harlow? Tomato to the leader. We go in first? You sure do. There's a clearing one mile up ahead. That's where you put down. What's the point? We could just drop some jelly. That'd take care of it. Captain Harlow's decision, not mine. We'll cover you. If anything wiggles downstairs, we'll waste it. You're so sweet. Going in now. You've only got 12 minutes this time, Captain. Should be an ammo dump. It looks abandoned, just our luck. Us two already. What do you want to do? Wipe out the platoon? Come on now, soldier. I gave you an order. Move your ass. We'll cover you. Almost made it. Probably clear there now. Let's take the line he took. Move out! Take it easy now. I'll be back for you later. Mother.
Uno. Let's go. Come on, move it. Are you gonna wait for Sarge, Captain? Move your ass. You were soft. Don't know, man. Did see? Hey, man. Did you see South come back? Yeah, he's coming. He's coming, man. Tom, all right, we're going. Huh? Oh, shit, let's get you out of here. Come on. See that fucker Harlow will wait for us? Yeah, he knows I came back to get you. Come on. Oh. Oh. Take it easy. Oh. We'll get there. Come on, hurry up! The others. They didn't make it. Let's go. Someone else coming. I saw the sergeant. Let's bring him top back. Time's up. Go. Get us in the air. Always on schedule. You win again. You better believe. 
believe it. I'm going to jump so high they're not going to be able to measure it. You know, I was supposed to be in the Olympics last year. And then I got involved in all this. Listen, tell me later, okay? Sal. Sal, I want to ask Shh, Charlie's. Sal, Sal, that you? Who else? Oh. <laughs> you lucky a slob, oh God! No, I'm not. I'm just wonderful. Oh, come on. He said, easy. I got you. Step coming up. Okay. okay. Uh, why don't you just leave me? You can make it on your own. Don't be an asshole. Uh, I'm gonna make money off of you when we get back to the tracks. Yeah. Have those bookies pee in their pants. Uh, down you go. Yeah, easy. Somebody's heard that shot for sure. Uh. Here they come. Listen to them squawk. Hey, what I mean, don't you? Hey, damn. No, 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 no. Lee Freeman, evening post reporter. Sergeant Pike's the one to see. Fair, sir. Thanks. Sergeant Pike. Captain Harlow's waiting for you. Thank you. Hey! There's a couple of guys over there. Coming in on a canoe. Looks like Sergeant Macho. Get your hey, hey, Sergeant Macho. Oh, it's you again. Well, give me the proof that your commander is sending you guys out to be slaughtered for no reason. I want to print it. 
It's common knowledge. And your silence is tantamount to defending. My silence? Here, Sal. Welcome back, Thanks. huh? Out here on my fourth tour. I'm not gonna fuck up now and squeal on the army. Harlow's not army. He's just a rotten apple. Nah, uh, we're all in this together. You too. Hey, listen. Are you trying to save a couple of kids' lives, or are you trying to up your paper circulation? Oh, don't say that. And you do your job and let me do mine. That way we're all clean when payday rolls around. So nothing, huh? That's right. <laughs> Sergeant Machi reporting. Three dead and one man with his leg blown half away, Captain. Sergeant. And a single pass by a Skyhawk with two rockets could have done the job. I didn't hear that, Sergeant. Now, I realize you're tired and that we're all a bit strung out. You did hear it, sir. Now, some so strung out they can't make rational decisions anymore. You're walking on thin ice, Maggio. Even if you are one of my men. We're not your men, Captain. We're just numbers. I was to raise your rank on the Saigon scoreboard. Navarro! Yes, sir. Yes? Okay, Red Fox, just a moment. Yeah, Red Fox, where the hell did you get to? You faded right out. Listen, switch to band six. I repeat, band six, over. Strength five, Red Fox. I need you. Can you give me your coordinates? But I warn you, Macho. One more act of insubordination. Roger, and all the citations five. in the world won't save your ass. Dismissed. Yes, sir. Take your money. Take it. And you two, Casanovas, let's go home. Your night's ah, over. Ah, Sarge, can't we just stay a little longer? I'm enjoying myself. Move. Now. Hey, Sarge. 
Didn't you go to the hospital today? Yeah, the operation. What happened? How's Tom? Uh -oh. I had to cut off his leg. No more athletics. About like killing him. Yeah. Let's go. Hey, America. You no stay here no more? Gotta go, baby. You know what I mean no more? Hey, man. How are you? Good. Good. Hey, girl, I'm sorry. You know, I like this place. Got it's the best like pussy that. in town. <laughs> the best. Uh, the best hash as well. Hey, Sarge, I was just trying it. I don't need it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Don't you believe me? Hey, fuckhead. Should I? You think that shit is gonna get you over the fear, but it doesn't. It slows you down and gets you dead. Knowledge is power. What? Oh, look how he's smiling. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> Hey, soldier, take this rag off your head and wear your beret. Ah, oh, come on, Sarge. This ain't a parade ground, for Christ's sake. He's turning out worse than Captain Harlow. Come on, keep moving. Go. Come on, you guys. Let's go. Move it. Come on. What's the matter? Aren't you nah, there's ladies? no peace. The horny. Bye. Hey, what are those? Hey, look what I got here, you guys. What is it? I'm in Hey, what? Get it right out. Okay, move it. Come on. Looks like a cock with tassels. No way. It's a Hollywood suppository. Why, Sergeant Maggio, this here's a very useful object. It's an enema for Captain Harlow. Watch your language, soldier. Hey, that's yes, what sir. you need, kid. Sorry, Flush sir. out yes, your brain. Sir. Well, I don't know what it is, but I still better would knock that shit out of that bastard. Christ! Oh, hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Jesus Christ! Did you see what that filthy motherfucking bastard of a little kid did? Let's see if we can find him. How did it happen? Booby uh, trap. Uh, Get the uh, other side. Uh, 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 okay. Uh, Gently. Okay, I got him. Here. Uh, uh, come on, move it, move it. Uh, the corridor to the left. In here. No, I'm sorry. You'll have to wait outside. What's the score? We're doing all we can, don't worry. He disappeared. He's in surgery. An emergency, a soldier. Well, what happened? A booby trap, I think. Hey, I hear your buddy got booby trapped. That's what happened to me, only I got lucky. It didn't go off right, so I just got a scratch. It's worse here than in the jungle. Come on, soldier. Sorry about your friend. Koji, come on, I calm down. Died. Nobody's Not to blame dead. for it. Stop it! It's all right. It's all right that he died. I tell you, Harlow commands the hottest unit in my division. He's one of the best officers in the whole damned army. But he's gone off the deep end. And I should give you carte blanche to write that in your column? Don, I write what I observe. What I'm asking you to do is to step in, save lives. Harlow is out to polish his performance rate at any cost. But just in the last four months, he's racked up nearly a 60% casualty rate. Where the hell you get those figures from? 
They're classified. Maybe so. The point is, they're accurate. Well, this is war for Christ's sake, not the Super Bowl. But it's over, Don. We can't win it. We're getting the hell out. And there isn't any sense in dying anymore. But kids still are. And the people back home want to know why. They want to understand, Don. All right. So what exactly you want me to do? Shackle Harlow. You know, just enough to restrain him. Not so easy. <laughs> Get that door open, will you? It's still airborne. Oil pressure's zero. Then let's get her down, man. Come on, put her down. In that hornet's nest? Hey, get her. Are you asleep? No, sir. Go on, hit him. Two men and two to base. Get some more air cab in here, damn it. This is Tornado 2. Come in, 9. We need a lift home. You read me? Over. Affirmative, 2. You got Charlie trouble. Stay in cover. I'll call reinforcements. Over. We sure appreciate it. Look, how about you spray Charlie with some 50s if you can see him? Over. care of him. Nine's got company, Sarge. Looks like they're coming to get us. They will make it with that goddamn son of a bitch machine gun. Come on.
Hit the dirt! Come on, let's get out of here. Shooting. I'm gonna try to get behind him. Okay. Nine to six. We're heading down for the pickup. Why don't you spread a little joy on Charlie? I'm sticking to gunships. That's it, then. Let's move them out. Tony covers. I'll watch it. What the hell took you guys so long? You should say that. I was going to ask you the same thing. Um, three or four more and we're set. Come on, let's hustle. Okay, That's let's it. go. Yeah. Hang on. Do I disturb? Tom, how are you? Not bad. Just when I sleep, I dream of the Olympics. And I wake up. I uh, brought you some papers and magazines. Feel like reading? Sure, yeah. Is there anything about me? No, no, I wouldn't do that without talking to you first. Would you like me to write a piece on you? Huh. I can see it now. The one-legged wonder. The hopping hero. I don't need that. This is the end of the line. I come over here thinking I'm going to help somebody. Us, them. Who's being helped? The arms industry, drug pushers, prostitutes, black marketeers. Did you ever try to move the sheet with your foot and your foot wasn't there? They managed to pick up the boys. Tom, I'll come back soon. Come on, 
Enough of those kids. You're right, Sal. Slow <laughs> down. Slow down. Slow down. He'll get his all right, but not this way. You'd just be playing into his hands, man. Yeah. Yeah. You gonna take it easy? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Some other bastard's gonna pay. That mission was no more than an exercise for his goddamn ego. Tom didn't have to lose his leg. He could be alive today, and so could the others. Just cool down. He's responsible, and he should pay. Come on, let me out. Oh, He's okay. Get up. Don't worry. Go easy. Sergeant Maggio. <laughs> Have you no respect for that uniform you're wearing? What were you saying? That I'm responsible for Kowalski's death and I should pay? Oh. Sal, no! Oh. 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 Stay out of this! Let him go! <laughs> This is just what I wanted. There'll be a court-martial. that man. Sergeant Pike, arrest that man. taught West Pointers to send a man before a court-martial that way. You were that scared of Maggio. Was he getting to you that much that you had to do it? Freeman, personally, I couldn't care less what you write in your lying rag. But just for the record, I have never stepped beyond either my rank or my duties. Meaning what? That your men owe you blind obedience? That a man should get his head blown off rather than question a senseless order? Without discipline, there's no army. And it's not so easy to command, believe me. It's far easier to obey. I wonder if that's what Maggio is thinking right now.
Get the hell out of here. They're after the train. Can't you drive any faster? Go straight out that way. Mike couldn't tell me much. He was knocked out. If we let Maggio get away, sir, it could have a very negative effect on morale. Well, if he gets into the jungle, it'll be like looking for a needle in a haystack. I believe he'll head for the Cambodian border, sir. And from there to the nearest port. And, of course, the first ship to a neutral country. Sounds very romantic, if he can get through VC country. But then I wouldn't put anything past Mr. Maggio. Pike, I know you're rooting for your buddy, but it's going to be tough for him. Hey. 
Man, this is ridiculous. I don't see him anywhere. You think we're gonna find him way up here? Morgan from the 14th says he saw him this morning. Shit, you give that twerp half a minute and he'll tell you had lunch with Ho Chi Minh. Shit. This is for you. Come on, take it. Good. This is for you. I thought I could learn. điều tra nó có ở đâu từ đâu nó đến ai mang nó đến tới repeat please you are a green beret do you confess to your crimes and those of your government against the revolutionary people of vietnam it will be better for you You admit everything. Now then, please. You are a green beret. What do you want me to say, you asshole? I am a green beret. I do, darling, don't I? So, do you admit to your crimes? That sergeant, Salvatore Maggio. Serial number six one two three four one eight. Yes, I'm a green beret, as you damn well know. You shit face. <laughs> 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 Except that I'm in this the same as you are, you son of a bitch! Hey, you, you fucker! Hey, you! Let me help you out. Hey, help me 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 out. Hey, Oh! <laughs> 
Cái gì cho nào ăn à, nó canh cơm Tại sao? Tại sao dù sao nó cũng chết mà Cần gì cho nó chết chứ rồi thằng lính Mỹ mà. Mày thấy không? Nó không thèm ăn mà Tao đưa cho nó, nó cũng thèm ăn nữa Thằng này đi Tăng cường người cánh dưỡng nha Thôi mấy bạn đi rồi mình đi chơi không Ê tụi mình đi tới thằng tụi binh chúng mày American You want a cigarette? You want? You want? Bên tay mặt rồi không? Bụi bên tay trái đây 
đó việc chưa như cứng này nghe chưa rồi chưa sẵn sàng cứ cái đâu đi vô kéo dây thẳng nào cắn ra Maybe eat pig shit some good. You come out, you American talk. <coughs> Maybe no one. American pigs talk shit all time. <laughs> bye bye, American. Ah, I'm here and ready to roll. When do we move out? What the hell? Hmm. Oh, no, Freeman. This is a military operation. I can't take civilians along. Not even Asia's number one hotshot war correspondent. All officers will assist me in every way. Sign General Taylor. Do you think he really means to desert? Sergeant Maggio has deserted, Freeman. Past tense. But he'll never make it to neutral territory. I guarantee you. Well, in any case, I intend to be there, if and when. Madge is the best. I trained him. He's perfectly capable of slipping past the Viet Cong and making it to the border, and within the space of a week. You rooting for him? Why not? It would only go to show the men in my outfit can do anything. But you say you'll never make it. What's your secret? Didn't you say you intend to be there? Be the front row. Ê, thằng Mỹ! Thằng tụi Bình hình như chết rồi, cả anh lại đây, nhanh lên! Chết rồi à? Chạy ra lên! Chạy xuống anh em, chạy xuống lên! Chạy xuống lên! Chạy xuống lên! Chạy xuống lên! Nó không còn nhúc nhích nữa! Chạy xuống lên thôi, chạy lên! Chúc một tay của anh em! Nhanh lên, đặt lập đặt lập xuống đây, nhanh lên! Ê, mày quên tôi mặt, mày kéo qua đây như vậy! Nhanh lên! Đéo lên coi! Để nó nằm xuống nè! this morning. You boys stay put, we won't be long. You think he may know something useful? Maybe. All set? Freeman goes with us, right? Yes, sir. Mr. Freeman, let me take it. Oh, thanks. We got some information, sir. Claims that the smoke spotted from the helicopter was an ammunition dump destroyed by a solitary green beret. Were any of our units in that area at the time? No, that was north of Z Dock. We pulled out of there a month ago. I guess you're married. Sure it was, right, Harlow? 
Charlie's didn't know what they were in for when they grabbed him. Control this sector, right? Uh, ben, yeah, it's portable. And we did control that sector. It's the Arvin's taking it over. That's where. That's where he'll try to cross, I'm sure of it. God knows we did enough simulated crossings and training together. And there's no Cambodian presence for miles. Listen, we're pulling out. In case you, uh, hadn't noticed it. So don't come around breaking my chops about your damn deserter. He's not just any deserter. Oh, yeah, I know. He's a Superman. Oh, you green caps are Superman. Bring those weapons. Load them. Those scrunts get a weekend on the clap in Saigon after a six-month stretch of wandering around and stepping on booby traps. While these guys chauffeur in by chopper for a 10 minute bang bang and get a silver star and three weeks in Honolulu. Well, oh, shit on You go on out there and get your super ass yourself. I'll have to let Saigon know about this. Oh, do, by all means. The radio shack's to your right. I'm sure Saigon is all the time in the world by now. What's with that guy? Is he human? Doesn't he have a home to go back to? Careful, boy. Captain Harlow has many friends in very high places. Hmm. I don't care if he has a direct line with God. This war is over, damn it. We hope it is. Good night. Move it! Four 
of you that way. When it started, he was heading downhill. He's got to be hiding. Come on. Charlie, guys. You really think it might be the Sarge? What the hell else? You know we got this far along. What do we do if we catch him? Come in. He's a deserter. Don't you care what'll happen to him? Sorry, dude. He's a buddy, ain't he? You're like Judas. Shoot at us? It's not him. It's goddamn Charlie's booby traps I'm worried about. Over there, it's clear. Fucking Sal has us out here in the jungle in a wild goose chase. Let's go, come on! And don't keep bunching together like sheep! Let's go, let's go, spread out. Come on, come on! Wake up! Watch out. We're pulling back to Da Nang. One step closer to home, thank God. Going right now? Yeah, right now. We're moving so fast, I almost forgot you. Well, where's Captain Harlow? Uh, Harlow. He's given up on us. He's gone over to Arvin Command to break their chops. Can you loan me a jeep? A jeep? Well, I shouldn't, but... Uh, okay. Thanks. Thank you. 
I love it. A third tour out here, I'm on my way home, and now they decide to come. Yeah, USO spectacular the decade. Bob Hope, Rackle Welch. Uh -huh. How much you want to bet they cancel it? Hell, with all this shit that's going on right now, I, I guarantee it. Yeah, they'll cancel. They ain't gonna walk in here with all this crap going on. Hey, looks like Willie's coming back. He's bracing off for 25 minutes. What's going on? Johnson, tell him to get his ass back to work. Hey, Willie! You guys over there. Come on. All right, all you guys out there, now hear this. There is a Green Beret deserter who could be trying to cross over at this point. He's dangerous and probably armed. The order is to shoot on sight. Hey, go now, you all get. How did you find me? Well, I'm about as easy to get rid of as Madger was to catch. He came right through here without firing a shot. Kind of gets to you, doesn't it? On the contrary, Mr. Freeman. I'm rather proud. He's one of my men. Is your attitude supposed to mean you haven't trapped him? I should think it's obvious. I created my men one by one. I can think their thoughts before they do. So where's Maggio hiding? He's here, near the river. He tried to cross it last night, but I had the whole 46 Arvin Ranger Battalion out there ready for him. And now, he can't go backwards or forwards. It's just a matter of hours. Harlow, the war is over. This overtime is useless. Let him go. No. We didn't lose this war out here. You soft-brained stateside lost it. 
Just pray that someday in maybe 10 or 15 years, you don't regret all your whining when you find out what a mistake we made by pulling out. I'm talking about today, Harlow. I'm asking you to save a man, a man who did his job. I can't. What he's got coming, he's going to get. For God's sake, Captain. That's enough, Mr. Freeman. I wouldn't want to be in your shoes when the Pentagon gets the report on you. I wouldn't want to be in your shoes, period. Recorded to Charlie. Urgent message for you, Charles. Send over. Oh, there. What's so urgent? Lower. Lieutenant Green Berets are flying the river, heading for sector 269. Warn your army units not to start shooting. Anymore. Got it. Who are you? Your company? What do you think they're doing? Over. How the fuck should I know, man? Afraid I need your wheels. Now stay off this way. Sorry. I'm finally yanking with a good ally. Over. Message to all ARVN units in Sector 269. Please report immediately the presence of a lone American soldier in your area. Over and out. <laughs> Captain, you'd never get off that hill unless he could fly. I wouldn't put it past him. Your men know that they're to shoot on sight? They can't understand why, but they know. I have six units. What the hell? It's him! It's him! It's him! Did you miss, soldier? <laughs> Easy. Captain, I'll be right with you, sir. Hey, hey, wait a minute! Hey, wait for me, Captain! Follow them? No. It's better to go onto the bridge. That's where we're headed. And I bet ten bucks on Sal. You're on. Okay.
Firing squad for this. You're finished, Harlow. You're all washed up. As an officer, you're dead. I'm gonna make sure of that. You had your power, and you abused it. Well, it's all over now. Pull the trigger, damn you. The only thing, Captain, if I shot you, you'd be the victim and a hero. Wait! And it is this bridge that Sergeant Salvatore Maggio must cross to reach the safety of the neutral territory of Cambodia. What's happening over there? A woman that wants to cross over the bridge. What do we do, sir? She wants to cross the border. We found it down there. Don't worry about it. It's not up to us anymore. They run things here now. Go on. And get your Talk gear organized. Them. I want to be out of here in 30. Son of a bitch. Aren't you going to give the order to fire? I'm a spectator. I'm just here to pull my men back. They shouldn't be shooting at us, right? You're gonna have to make the decision here. To kill Captain Harlow. some of those guys sitting in the Pentagon and the Americans at home could see you. For what you really are, man. Come on. Come with me. Hey, Jung Jung, get them light. Let me 